Hi, my name is Henry Sagerman. These are geodesic domes and geodesic spheres. Uh, so suppose you want to make a polyhedral approximation to a sphere. Uh, so there's lots of different ways to do this, um, and this is maybe one of the simplest ways to go. Um, so start with an icosahedron, uh, which is in some sense the most spherical of the regular polyhedra, uh, and then start subdividing the faces. So this guy has four triangular faces for each one triangle um, of the icosahedron, and you can, you can keep going. So um, this one has, again, four triangular faces for each one triangle of this, so 16 triangular faces for each face of the icosahedron. So to see what's going on uh, in detail, I've got these, uh, these larger models. So this is uh, five triangles of the icosahedron, and I've scaled these so that they fit over each other. So, so this, uh, this is the, the first subdivision. So start with one triangle of the icosahedron and subdivide, uh, subdivide it into four, and you get these extra vertices. And what you want to do is move those extra vertices uh, radially outwards onto the sphere that circumscribes the icosahedron, and you get something that's, uh, that's more spherical. And then uh, do it again. Um, so this guy has four triangles for each um, single triangle of the, the, the first subdivision, and already you're getting something that's, that's very uh, spherical. Um, it's a little harder to see on the, the geodesic sphere models, sort of where are the subdivisions, how is this working? Um, so the, the, the trick here is to look for the degree 5 vertices. So the, these degree 5 vertices on the icosahedron, and they stay degree 5 when you start subdividing. So, um, so here's a, a degree 5 vertex, and here's another one, and there's one more. And so um, there are the, the four triangles that uh, used to be a single triangle on the icosahedron. And you can do the same thing on this guy. There's a degree 5 vertex, there's another one, and there's a third one. And so these 16 triangles used to be one triangle on the icosahedron. So this is... Uh, geodesic domes and geodesic spheres.